Now, Alex, you were the subject of a piece in The Australian by our mate Pembo who wrote, at the centre of these tensions, these are tensions between the moderates and the conservatives, at the centre of these tensions is one of the most polarising figures in Australian liberal politics, mm. hardline conservative Senator Alex Antic. He goes on to say how you are a reviled figure in moderate liberal circles in SA and that many were deeply unimpressed by your actions last year, withdrawing support for the Morrison government over vaccine mandates. Uh, what's your response to that piece? I would have thought you've been vindicated as far as the mandates go. Yeah, look, I, I think myself and Senator Gerard Rennick certainly have been. I mean, I, I think the whole thing, the point needed to be made and uh, and we made it and I don't regret that for a second, regardless of what so-called, uh, you know, faceless men say in the background, whatever. The reality is I made a promise to the Liberal Party members in South Australia to stand for our values regardless of uh, thick and thin and I've done that and I'll keep doing it. But yeah, I mean it does, it, it, I always like reading that. It's almost like it is reading about someone else. Like I, I can't feel the horns growing out of my head but uh, presumably they're there. I don't know. Hardline conservative. What does that mean? I mean that, that's that's sort of, you know, centre-right 10 years ago. So, uh, look, I, I don't know what to make of that. Like, they'll leave the, the commentariat to make their <laughs> conversation. In the meantime, I'll just continue to stand for what, what we should stand for and we'll forge on regardless. Yes, I think hardline conservative means basically you've got some principles and backbone and apparently that's not allowed in the Liberal Party anymore. It causes all sorts of polarisation. Uh, Senator Alex Antic, thank you so much mm. for joining me tonight.